Good afternoon, and welcome to Warhill High School's 2021 graduation ceremony. My name is Jeff Carroll, and I'm the very proud principal of Warhill High School. Everyone, please remain standing for our national anthem. If everyone would remove their caps also. Thank you. Please, everyone, be seated. Thank you, Warhill Band, under the direction of Mr. David Enlow, for your rendition of Pomp and Circumstance. And thank you, Warhill Choir, under the direction of Miss Emily Evans, for leading us in the Star Spangled Banner. We appreciate the efforts you made to perform today and enjoyed hearing final performances from our seniors. Parents, families, friends, colleagues, graduating seniors, Dr. Heron, distinguished members of the Williamsburg James City County School Board, members of the superintendent's leadership team, Warhill faculty, staff, and other invited guests. On behalf of our dedicated faculty and staff, I welcome you to this wonderful celebration of graduation for the class of 2021 here at Wanner Stadium. Congratulations, seniors. This is your day to shine. The faculty and staff of Warhill High School are most proud of you. You worked hard and achieved great things during your high school tenure. This class has earned millions of dollars in scholarships and grants. Additionally, our seniors have many opportunities ahead, including employment opportunities, military involvement, technical schools, and two and four year collegiate study. We have students attending 198 colleges in 27 different states. <laughs> Seniors, I am confident you often feel as if the past four years passed in an instant, while there are other times you thought the day, week, semester, or Zoom session would never end. Through each experience, whether it's the classroom, a competition, community service, a fine arts performance, an athletic event, club activities, or just time spent with your friends. You grew as an individual and became the unique person you are today. And here we are on this, the 18th day of June, 2021, honoring you, our graduating class. We are very proud of you. You are, and we are, Warhill High School.
Parents and family, thank you for your partnership. Without you, we would not have this phenomenal group of students. Your support has enabled our school community to thrive and facilitate a school culture that promotes excellence. Congratulations to you for being a positive influence in your child's life and getting him or her to this special graduation day. At this time, I would like to ask members of the superintendent's leadership team, WJCC school board, and other elected local officials to stand and be recognized. Thank you for your service to our War Hill students and community, and thank you for taking the time to be here today with us. Each year, it's customary to recognize the two students who have earned the highest cumulative grade point averages during their high school years. It gives me great pleasure to introduce to you Charlotte Croucher, the salutatorian for the class of 2021. Charlotte is the daughter of Mark and Kelly Croucher. Charlotte, we wish you well as you attend the College of William and Mary in the fall. The valedictorian of the graduating class of 2021 is Tessa Saparito. Tessa is the daughter of Salvatore and Marilyn Saparito. Tessa, we extend our good wishes to you as you attend the University of Virginia in the fall. The Honors Program of Williamsburg was instituted in 2003 to encourage highly motivated students to earn special recognition for their outstanding efforts in independent study. Students pursuing the honor seal required to complete a minimum of five AP courses and take the test, finish a four course sequence in a global language, design and complete a 25 hour community service project, and design and complete an in-depth honors project with a research component. This year, Olivia Garrett has completed these requirements. <laughs> Olivia is the daughter of John and Angela Garrett. Her honors project was entitled Latin, the, living, the language of the living. Olivia, we wish you well as you attend Sweetbriar College in the fall. Charlotte, Tessa, and Olivia, we commend you for your academic pursuits, your many accomplishments, your leadership, your example and your commitment to the highest standards of learning and academic integrity. Congratulations on a job well done. Each year, a committee of faculty graduates as speakers during commencement. Please welcome our first speaker, Tessa Saparito, with her speech entitled, Not Another COVID Speech. But overall, the experience was still kind of the worst. When people think back on the graduating class of 2021, I expect they'll say, oh yeah, those are the unfortunate seniors that missed almost their entire senior year because of the pandemic. And to a certain extent, that's true. We missed our homecoming, our prom, some of our spirit weeks and sports, and just the simple act of seeing our teachers and peers at school in person for most of the year. Now, for some of us extreme introverts, this wasn't always a bad thing, but I still felt I missed out. I mean, we didn't even get to run in a giant circle in our gym during the pep rally to show off the fact that we're seniors and therefore better than everyone else. And think about how hard it was for us to make the yearbook. Shout out to those of you that actually sent us pictures. But despite all the negativity that presented itself because of the pandemic, I want us to think about more than just COVID when we think about high school. I mean, we've been in school for 12 years. There has to be something other than COVID that made us special, right? I'll start with something to happen to me during high school that makes my experience a little unique. On my very first day of freshman year, I ended up in the counselor's office bawling like a baby because I was overwhelmed with the very idea of being in high school. Even if it was absolutely mortifying at the time, I can laugh at myself now. And here I am giving a speech at, gradu at graduation so obviously something has changed enough for me to be standing here. 
Now, this is not to say that every day after my first was smooth sailing. In fact, freshman year was still a struggle for me, although I did meet one of my best friends to this day. So thank you, Taylor, for sticking around me this long. Sophomore year, I found my place. I joined theater as a stage manager, and I found something I was good at. Joining an after-school activity honestly might have been more of a challenge for me than high school itself. So thank you to anyone who participated in theater while I did for making me feel welcome and for teaching me to be a leader. Junior year was incredibly difficult, to say the least, as it was for most of us. Every day of 11th grade was a struggle, and for the first time in my life, I had to ask for help from teachers and counselors and those around me. So thank you to any teachers in my life, any guiding adults, my friends and my peers for keeping me sane, and especially Mrs. McLaughlin for being my emotional support English teacher all of these years. See, this year obviously was different to say the least. At some points, I hardly felt like a high schooler at all, so I had to learn about what it'll be like when I'm on my own and have to rely on myself. So the final person and the most important person in my humble opinion that I would like to thank is me. I worked hard, I got here, I deserve it, and so do you. So take a moment to think about all the people that you'd like to thank, and at the top of that list, thank yourself. No matter how many people helped you get here, the work that you put in to be here today should not go unnoticed. Ever since that disaster of my first day of high school, I've grown content here. And now, after four years of being at Warhill, I think that I finally got it figured out. I learned who my friends are and where I fit in. I learned how to connect with teachers and peers, and I learned how to be independent. But now high school is over, and I have to figure things out all over again. And I'm terrified. I'm just as terrified, if not more so, as I was before my first day of freshman year. But hopefully I won't cry this time. I think it's important to remember that even though most of us are technically adults, we aren't done being kids yet. Every year as a young person is different. I'm not the same person I was freshman year or even last year, and I expect I won't be the same person at this time next year. And although many of us have grown together thus far, most of us are going our separate ways now. Things are going to change. It's inevitable. Even though I feel like I'm going in blind sometimes, Warhill has given me some of the tools that I'll need to succeed in the upcoming months and years. So it's true that the end of our junior year and the entirety of this year were sometimes miserable and completely different than what we expected. But I hope you'll remember more about your time here. I hope you'll remember that there's more to the class of 2021 than being the class of COVID. But I also know that there's more out there for all of us. The possible fear and anticipation you feel now is justified. But if you were able to get through high school in these times, you can probably get through whatever is in your future. And let's just hope that whatever it is, it's not another pandemic. Congratulations. Thank you, Tessa. Our final speaker is Elizabeth Spaltoff with her speech entitled, One Step Closer. Good afternoon, friends and family. Today's an exciting day. I'm honored to be here to help congratulate the class of 2021, and I would like to take a moment to thank the faculty, administration, family, friends, Quizlet, Yahoo Answers, Cookout, and SparkNotes this afternoon to help celebrate a huge milestone. Every student's separate journey brought them here today, and though these 13 years of schooling have given us the bumps and bruises of adolescence, we are stronger, tougher, and smarter from it. This afternoon, we sit here in the caps and gowns that we have waited all our lives to wear. To be perfectly honest, I feel like I should be submitting a journal review tonight for Mr. Lish or reading guide for Ms. Scully, so sitting here in front of you is all still shocking to me. All the moments in the last four years that have brought us to this spot right here and right now have, without question, shaped us into the people we are today as we prepare to leave Warhill High School. When most of my older brothers spoke at graduation, they talked about planning and doing, but we haven't been able to do much of either in the past year. Even still, amidst the most challenging year of our lives, we pushed on and learned a lot about ourselves in the process. Time alone at home allowed us to develop hobbies like painting, hiking, or even those Chloe Ting workouts. Spending much more time with our families and ourselves allowed for us to appreciate the people in our lives and grow closer to those we love. Though there are benefits, however small, of virtual schooling, there are also many challenges. 
Rolling over to turn on our laptops and attend school every day took a huge toll on our mental health, more than any of us could have seen coming. It was hard not to think about all the moments that would have happened if everything were normal, and it was really difficult when every day felt the same. It was so easy to feel alone and isolated and when I couldn't see friends and teachers at school every day, and the resolve of every graduate here was definitely put to the test. However, these hardships make today all the more reason to celebrate. Everyone here has persevered through emotional, mental, and physical hardships to be here today. We're graduating high school, and that is something to be proud of. If this year proved anything, it is that you are stronger than you give yourself credit for. Small accomplishments are still accomplishments, and no large goal is achieved without the baby steps that take you to it. Whether it be that chemistry UT you submitted at 11.59, or watching every single one of those Mr. Beck does your homework videos, these small victories shine light on success in our future. There are no easy paths without obstacles, but don't let those obstacles consume you. Embrace them. Dive into them head first like you have nothing to lose. So, Warhol High School, class of 2021, I urge you all to celebrate every accomplishment, no matter the size. Push through any obstacle that may be in your way, and don't take anything for granted. Do not forget to say I love you sincerely and often, and remember to hug your parents more. I hope you are all as proud of yourselves as I am of you. With that being said, current graduates, you are great today. You have done great things and have aligned your attitudes, your actions, and your mindsets to the tenets of the Warhol Way. Congratulations, class of 2021. Thank you. Now the senior class officers will present senior class memories. This year, the 2021 class officers will be represented by Lillian Snyder, president of the senior class. Please watch the screen behind me as Lillian shares these memories. Good afternoon to my fellow classmates and peers. Thank you to all who supported us for the past four years and coming to take part of the graduation of the class of 2021. Thank you especially to the administrators, teachers, families, and the other senior class officers. During our freshman year, we all realized high school wasn't quite like high school musical, but more of learning how to navigate around the many hallways and realizing the seniors were practically giants. Many of you may remember freshman orientation and wondering why everyone was jumping and screaming at you, but after that, I became an orientation leader myself, so they must have done something right. While freshman year appeared to be scary, it emphasized the importance of finding your people through different activities and clubs. Sophomore year, you finally knew Pump It Up and Hype halfway decent and knew every time you saw Mr. C or Mrs. Connie, you'd have a smile on your face. Our sophomore year pep rally was the year we finally had a sense of belonging because we weren't the quietest class anymore. We may have spelled sophomore wrong on our poster, but at least we didn't lose in tug of war. Our sophomore year also represented unity amongst Warhol as the whole school cheered and gathered for Mr. C, our favorite custodian, after we dedicated and named the student center after him. Junior year, we finally were upperclassmen and could help the seniors yell at the freshmen to move back to the football student section. Our football team junior year went 8-0, and many might have thought, is this the year we beat Lafayette? Unfortunately, it wasn't. We still went to cook it after, though. Looking back, many can relate to junior year being one of the most stressful years beca because juniors were forced to juggle many hardcore classes while trying to figure out to what to do with their future at the same time. With the full schedule and busy days, junior year seemed to be one of the hardest, but we still look back and carry the memories with us. Senior year. While this isn't the year we expected, we were finally able to understand that when we were warned our four years of high school would fly by, they weren't lying. This year tested our perseverance and pushed us to work our hardest as we were forced to adapt to a completely different school year. We were guided to have a unique perception of all of our years of high school, especially senior. As we approach new beginnings and times of change, I hope each of you continue to follow the Warhill way with pride. With that being said, congratulations, class of 2021. Lillian, if I could ask you to stand for a moment, please. Thank you for sharing those memories and representing your class officers. Also, on behalf of the War Hill School community, we would like to thank you and the class of 2021 for your gift of new microwaves to the Mr. C Student Center. Thank you, seniors. Our school certainly will benefit from your generosity. Congratulations, War Hill Class of 2021. Today is your graduation day. Graduates, 
During the past four years, you discovered adventures, met academic challenges, and learned the eight virtuals, virtues, courage, honor, integrity, leadership, loyalty, persistence, pride, strength, which comprise the War Hill Way. Today, we celebrate all that you have accomplished as you explored War Hill and the world around you. Along the journey, you learn how to explore from your first teachers, your parents and family. These people inspired and encouraged you. They embraced you when you were unsure, supported you when you stumbled, and celebrated you when you were successful. Families and parents, today's graduation is your moment also. As these graduates explored, you dreamed, hoped, and traveled along with them. Graduates, always remember the lessons, the words of wisdom, and the comfort received from your family. They are as proud of you as you are of yourselves. As you congratulate each other and yourself on accomplishments, do not forget these people who nurtured your exploration and enjoyed watching you grow into fine young men and women. Graduates, please take a moment to join me in thanking your parents and loved ones for supporting and guiding you all these years. When your explorations brought you to enter the doors of War Hill High School, you encountered some of the most devoted people I know, the faculty and staff of War Hill High School. They believe in what they do, and they dedicate themselves each day to preparing students for their futures in an ever-changing world. They work hard to, celebrate, uh, to support your explorations so that you may find success and do the things that engage you in life. Would the faculty and staff of War Hill High School please stand? You personify the War Hill Way on a daily basis. Thank you for being such an inspiration to our students and encouraging them to explore. The class of 2021 continues a War Hill tradition, the recognition of the most influential teacher as determined by a vote of the seniors. The class of 2021 has chosen to recognize Mr. John Gulick, science teacher. Mr. Gulick, will you please stand and be recognized? <laughs> Graduates, take time today to reflect on the experience of your high school years and the numerous memories discovered alongside your classmates, the unique members of the class of 2021. Remember how the voyage began at freshman orientation as you learned the War Hill Way. During your high school explorations, you attended classes, read books, calculated equations, completed science projects, and wrote papers. You participated in dances, athletic events, performances, after school activities, clubs, and community service opportunities. Contemplate these high school moments which bring you to this special day cherish these memories. Allow these thoughts to bring a smile to your face today and throughout your life. Know well your successes, failures, and lessons learned, and how these explorations shaped you into the individuals you are today. I leave you with the words of T.S. Eliot. We shall not cease from exploration, and at the end of all our exploring will be to arrive where we started and know the place for the first time. When you exit this stadium, you are no longer high school students. You are young adults. As you continue your journey, I challenge you to remember your explorations and to utilize the resources and skills gained during your 13 years of school. Soon it will be September, and your explorations will not return you to the safe, familiar walls of War Hill High School. No matter where your explorations lead, college, travel, work, or some other adventure, you will always have the heart of a lion. You are ready for success. Graduates, it is time for you to explore. War Hill High School will miss you. Congratulations, class of 2021. At this time, it's my pleasure to introduce our honorable superintendent, Dr. Owen Heron, who will assist with the certification of graduation.
Thank you, Dr. Carroll. This is a moment to feel a sense of tremendous pride and accomplishment. With much support and guidance along the way from family, friends, and of course, your teachers. Students, you have reached your goal. On behalf of the school board and staff, congratulations on your accomplishment. It is now time to award the diplomas. Dr. Carroll, do you certify completion of the graduation requirements by the Warhill High School class of 2021? Superintendent Heron, I affirm to you that these seniors before us today have met the requirements for graduation in Virginia. By the power vested in me by the Commonwealth of Virginia, I hereby grant certification of completion of graduation requirements to the students of the class of 2021, and I hereby authorize the issuance of diplomas. Dr. Carroll, you may proceed. Thank you, Dr. Heron. We now will begin our distinguished presentation of graduates of the Warhill class of 2021. Faculty, students, ushers, please take your places for the awarding of diplomas. Tessa Satina Saparito. Elizabeth Lynn Spaltoff. Brittany Ann Salmon. Brianna Amina Miracle Washington. Azil Eduardo Tenico. Ricky Lee Piggott. Alexandra May Plucker. Angel Jaden Cruz. Jamie Lynn De Jesus Lefever. Emma Grace Christ. Selena Lorena Caban. McKenna Ashley Eddings. Olivia Jane Garrett. Ashlyn Page Abbott. Charlotte Marilide Croucher. Isaac Francisco Dobeck. Darren Robert Sprague.
Tatiana Marie Asbury. Mason Walker Spence. Keyshawn Andres Odom. Logan Matthew Tooley. Evan William Martin. Colin Matthew Lugaro. Christopher Colton Potash. Keisha Odessa Lonin. Colin Sinclair Tucker the Fourth. Vincent Mendoza. Nathaniel John Garcia. Adriana Elizabeth Gone. Ali Scott Kiger. Lauren Diana Kerr. Evan Robert Haney. Riley Joe Brown. Stefania Maria Elidardi. Sydney Ann Crosetta. Allison Faye Cheney. Elizabeth Lindsay Knight. Ian Fletcher Shackley. Holly Lynn Taransky. Leah Marie LeCompte. Carly Nicole Price. Grace Louise Shadrax. Jordan Ryan Mariello Mendoza. Jada Lachey Walker. Marcus Jerome Rhodes. James Craston Scott. Maggie Montgomery Froelich. Bradley Thomas King. Logan Anthony Koselke. Jason Eugene Dickinson Crow. Kian Yerkeban Carapresso.
Michael Anthony Castanave. Aaron Danielle Collins. Emma Ann Bewley. Naisha Marie Hubbard. Aiden Christopher Berry. Noah Mitchell Wright. Jeremy Lamias Smith. Blake Mason Wagner. Connor Brian Trope. Keith Blair Thomas. Joshua Keith Ordery. Joshua Adam Yanez. Micaiah Rashad McDaniel. Jordan Anthony Pollard. Liberty Angel Rojas. Lucy Tab Griffith. Lindsay Judith Beck. Ethan David Hoff. Kayla Marie Dollar. My cow, Jermaine Brown. Trayvon Bryant. Chismer Ann Branscombe. Avery Lynn Fernandez. Kirsten Callie Flanagan. Ashley Caitlin, Caitlin Boquist. Sierra Lynn Mahalik. Crescencia Ariana Patronoster Cozart. Chancellor Lauren Washington. Chase Lewis Washington. Lillian Margaret Snyder. Emily Marie Watkinson. Meredith Brooke Shell. Logan Robert Mooney. Jordan Marissa Wright. Delaney Brianne Underwood. Lindsay Jewel Bryant. McKinley Lynette Dowdy.
Eden Noelani Lobsher. Casey Elizabeth Frost. Cayenne Enrique Dunbar. Zachary Tyler Hayes. Lance Patrick Gibson. Dylan Porter Howard. Hunter Davis Blackwell. Jabari Alexander Braxton. Destiny Janae Watson. Haley Elise Vivian. Jason Isaiah Pittman. Gavin Nicholas Menhart. Megana Grace Pritchard. Ellery Christina Tobler. Abigail Mackenzie Roggenbach. Roxana Evelise Rodriguez Colon. Colin Samuel Walls. Aiden Christopher Lowry. Hannah Nargiz Fairley. Kaylee Marie Gosselin. Nolan Patrick Forsyth. John Forrest Glasgow. Ethan Huggins. Ryan Anthony Hernandez Robles. Grace Eileen Dufour. Destiny Kathleen Kreider. Dylan Tyler Kreider. Forrest Lee Davis. Jacob Paul O'Neill. Cora Morgan Youngs. Jalen Daniel Neck. Andrew Thomas Riddick. Merrick James Shore. Elijah Jacob Yeager. Nathan Zoe Wan. Riley Scott Wigner. Alexander Maxwell Rogers. 
Isabella Lynette Mullins. Isabella Larissa Jones. Ramaya Saye King. Charisma Lee Green. Jayla Armani Jones. Amaya Delora Hudgens. Aziza Elizabeth Allen. Gwen Larnique Desmira Bassett. Isaac Nathaniel Horton. Benjamin Patrick Hogan. Nathaniel Tyler Bird. Riley Ann Mullen. Skyler Kaylee Thomas. Kira Larray West. Isabella Marie McLean. Charlotte Anne Marie Miller. Devin Lacey Southard. Jessica Leanne Wallbank. BJ Nogger. Matthew Tachi. Nico Rincon. Taylor Rose Smith Bright. Kamora Dejanay Hardy. Katora Ladell Cook. Ethan Ryan Kalupatan. Samuel Jason Brando. Trevor Steven Gomez. Sophia Aja Fitzgerald. Brianna Cosette Carlson. Molly Janine Connors. Benjamin Rayford Johnson. Devin Franklin Watson. Cody James Weagle. Ethan Quinn Sullivan. Hayden Alexander Sheldon. Emily Brooke Meadows. Sincere Xavier Montre Meekins. Yeah. 
Naya Nicole Ward. Tobias Moore. Ryrief Mahire Patton II. Charlissa Monea Page. Brandon William Richard Fitzpatrick. Dino Scott Grindle II. Isabella Marie Babb. Richard Bowden Driscoll. Amy Marie Batts. Janine Amir Crump. Peyton Olivia Bowie. Matthew Joseph Hippel. Kayla Amani Johnson. Kristen Demetria Andrews. Elijah Jerome Pollard. Killian Devin Phillips. Emily Kristen Martin. Jace Montgomery Little. Alexander Montgomery Lewis. Caleb Alexander Wooten. Andrew Dory Smalls. Marissa Logan Miller. Eleanor Grace Matkins. Emma Catherine Matkins. Isaiah Dwayne Lincoln Hurlbert. Elijah Taylor Fry. Zion, Zion Jeremy Funderbunk. Jonah Howard Helton. John Lester Duval the third. Stacy McLeod Graves Jr. Jaron Avery Isbell. Skyler Nicole Hackett. Cameron William Gunther. Angel Marie Johnson. Brinkley Caroline Yurko. Emily to no. Sydney Taylor Rich. Caitlin Elizabeth Richards.
Ethan Wade Sims. Charles Brody Satterfield. Patrick Los. Matthew Ryan Munger. Mitchell Antonio Tyler Jr. Jaden Deshaun Johnson. Malisha Elizabeth Brown. Lily Amana Collins. Kylie Paige Forziati. Isabella Rose Fall. Victoria Leanne Brinkley. Kendall Lene Hughes. Addison Renee Creek. Jordan Leanne Carter. Aliana Shade Cook. Miguel Ramon Soto. Amarion Daquan Roke. Eric Wayne Wilkerson. Torian Anthony Morris. Marnaja Lene Wallace. Jamira Lamani Tyler. Juliana Jewel Northen. Alicia Nicole Trost. Nadine Carmeth Menard. Shia Ainsley McClung. Theory Grace Tut. Autumn Taylor Clark. Grace Elizabeth Harper. Samantha Nicole Harms. Dylan Joseph Harms. Daniel Paul Fawaski. Grayson Michael Bishop. Logan Thomas Archibald. Dylan Michael Gibson. Ian Charles Che. Rebecca Lynn Milam. Taylor Rhea Palmer. Ashley Michelle Rute.
Kaylee Elizabeth Massey. Antoinette Elizabeth Pollard. Sierra Nicole Rosario. Kelsey Nicole Robertson. Ryan William Mitch Nikowski. Amari Cherie Majet. Sophia Areli Martinez. Riley Madison Harris. Naeem Benet Hutchinson. Maggie Elizabeth Fjord. Manuel Antonio Gutierrez. Alexis Marie Griffith. Madison Bell Gradziki. Isabella Rose Hosang. Destiny Alia Harris. Bisma Fida. Michaelia Aniani Elliott. Lilith Claire Martin. Isaiah Deshaun Williams. Nathan Phil Salangsang. Christian Tyler Miano. Monasia Lenise Leonard. Catherine Tingley Seip. Shelby Elizabeth Stokes. Hunter Thomas Stokes. Diana Jade Sachs. Mahima Shijo. Unique Harmony Banks. Jalen Kevon Langston. Deja Simone Hextall. Benjamin Patrick Kinley. Anthony William Mickelson Nestle Road. Devin Connor Housden. Cody Michael Hartle. Olivia Rochelle Bogus. Oh, 
Gabrielle Yvonne Delgado Delgado. Tanasia Markel Wynn. Jace David Spur. Kelsey Nicole Thompson. Noah Joshua Lee. Aaron Michael Bryant Thompson. Shanti Camone Rennick. Nashayla Joy Wright. Trinity Arjane Lee. Shaheem Jordan Taylor. Joseph Michael LaRose. David Gabrielle Grappi. Josiah Hazel Jadera Jackson. Victoria Brianna Henry. Matthew Kyle Morrison. Diego Salvador Estes. Isaac Ananias Anderson. Isaiah LaShawn Armstrong. Hannah Lene Johnson. Haley Noel Didion. Alexis Lynn Sweat. Owen Michael Wilson. Sanalbar Rashidi. Gabriel Zeladon. Parents, families, Dr. Heron, distinguished guests, and all invited guests, on behalf of the superintendent of schools and the faculty and staff of Warhill High School, I proudly present the graduated class of 2021. <laughs> Seniors, you may now move your tassels.
We'd like to thank everyone for joining us and joining our celebration today and wish each of you health, happiness, and success. And to the proud dads in the crowd, have a very special Father's Day on Sunday. We invite you now to witness the recession of the stadium. Graduates, last time you gotta listen to directions from me, please. Uh, <laughs> You will follow me and the other platform gas down the center aisle and off the field the opposite way that you entered the ceremony. Please then exit the stadium into the parking lot through the st student gate that you entered. Families and guests, please remain standing until all the graduates have exited the stadium. You'll meet your graduate in the parking lot. We ask families to celebrate at home or another place and avoid large gatherings in the parking lot. Thank you for your cooperation and have a safe and enjoyable summer.